Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we're gonna discuss all about how to deploy your React.js project on Hostinger. But before uploading the project, you need to have a hosting and also domain name. So I'm gonna show you how you can buy or get the domain and hosting from Hostinger and how you can deploy your React.js project on Hostinger. So first of all, you need to click the link which are appeared inside the video description once you click on it then you are able to see this one page inside this one page you need to enter the domain name so let's say i will get the domain node.jit and search the domain so here is the domain now node.jute i'm gonna use doda right i just show you how you can get that so I'm going to use this make it yours. Here is a two plans. The first one is premium hosting. Second one is business hosting. So in the premium hosting, I will get one year domain for free and I will more create more than 25 websites. I will get 25 gb storage of the ssd and many other things like uh, two mailbox per website so i'll get this one hosting by clicking the get premium bundle on there so i'm gonna show you another process guys but we need to fill uh, many other information inside there to get the hosting once I'll get the hosting, then I'm gonna show you how you can deploy your just project on hosting there, right? So inside this one page, have a one year domain for free and the hosting hosting plan. How many times you will get the hosting? Like uh, the default is twelve months, but I'm gonna increase it. I'm gonna get is forty eight months. I will pay more than $143.50. I will get the one year domain for free and 48 months hosting. Right, so I'm gonna click to continue. And once I click to continue, then I need to log in the account. Once I log in the account, then I need to fill all of the information that are required, like personal information, like your first name, last name, and payment method. So I'm going to show you the next process. Give me a second. Okay, guys. So once you log in your account, uh, you can use the GitHub or you can use the email like uh, you know, Google email to log in the account. Once you log in the account, then you need to fill all of the information that are required. The first name, last name, country, your mobile number, address, and so on so far. Once you click on continue, then you need to select your payment method and you need to enter the payment details once you will get the hosting then i will show you another process okay guys once you get the hosting and domain from hosting yeah, then the next process you need to click on the domains and select your particular domains where you will deploy your react, uh, react just website like i'm gonna select the learn to free by default you can't see anything else i'm gonna open it in the new tab as you can see this is the default 403 error so i'm gonna close it and click to manage website select the file manager and select the public underscore html open it you can't see anything else so this is the first process the first one is you need to buy a hosting and domain and you need to select your particular domain click to manage settings and select your public underscore html main root directory the next process is your react just project so i'm gonna open my vs code editor here's my project that i built on earlier uh, i think a few days ago i don't know i'm gonna execute the command npm run dev i'm gonna show you the project from my local pc like this one this is a complete responsive website that i have built so i will upload this one a local website as you can see localhost 
to my uh, this one domain like this one right so what I'm gonna do on there I'm gonna close this one project and stop it I need to execute the command npm run build once you execute this one command then you will get the folder as you can see dist folder inside the dist folder have a assets in the assets have a css file js file and index.html file so i'm gonna reveal this one folder and open it so this is index file i also open it i think this file is doesn't open on the page okay don't worry i will upload it okay so open the dist folder select all the files and folder two files in one folder just select it drag and drop inside your public underscore html directory you need to wait a couple of seconds please I reload this on page as you can see very simple few things you need to follow on that to deploy your react.js website on live server or on hosting or on server whatever you will call it so i hope you understood as well all about it so thank you very much for watching have a nice day